Hello, welcome back. Last time I finally solved some long-standing mysteries and uncovered a whole bunch of new ones. So, uh, I have like a lot of things wanting to take my attention. Space station, finally done. Uh, there's another secret level to find, presumably off of here to the right. Uh, my stats tell me. However, I don't want to kill my momentum on what's going on here. So like, the exit to this was clearly closed off by, uh, something. A block I didn't understand. The only way I saw out of this level was to take the portal, which took me here. So I'm just gonna follow the lead of this game and go to Final Showdown and see what happens. So for this, it appeared to me as though, um... I'm gonna guess this is a refresher for blocks that I will be seeing during this showdown. Uh, it appeared to me as though I would need to invent a route here that involves not crossing my own path and finding all of the, oh dear, uh, all of the things in probably like one run. Let's not worry too much about backtracking yet. How am I going to get the height for that? There must be like a, an orientation change here somewhere. All right, so right now I'm just not gonna worry about much other than, hey, I'm being chased. Let's go away from the thing that's chasing. What are those? They're blue, I don't know what that means. If I checkpoint, well, I've checkpointed. I don't know if that's a good idea. Okay, I don't, this thing doesn't pursue me like particularly quick. I can just sit here for a while. Okay, this route doesn't take me to the key card. I just want to get a, an idea of the layout here. Also, I need to test if, like, am I just oops, safe when I'm holding still? Probably not. Okay, so that's the amount of delay. Ah, but respawning at the checkpoint does erase the path. Okay, so for this run through this level, I will simply take advantage of that in order to gain a key card, arrive back at... Oh, I can't use that checkpoint again, though. So I need to find another one if I want to pull that off. Got it. How? No, I need to find an orientation switch, because that's also seemingly impossible to get to if I'm in this orientation. Found it. All right, so that'll help. Wow, this is a mega level. Quite a mega level. That's gonna require... I don't know what to get through. Alright, so I, I obtained a key card. So those just go away after I leave them. Got it. Until I do, they're happy to stick around. Oh, I need to... Eliminate that and then reorient. Okay, if I could find a second checkpoint, I could cycle back and forth between them and, uh... eventually get everything I need to get done done. This will work, except I'll be crossing my own path so it won't from here. Um, let's get some of these when they're around. This thing is always just like three seconds behind me or something, so I, it's not like I can outpace it, just all this really means is don't hold still and don't cross your own path. Uh, I'm crossing my own path here. Although, does it eventually, like, expire? Because it seems like... I totally came through here and no static residue is left, so it... It doesn't last for an infinite amount of time, and in fact, it's gone from here already. Okay, so this is shorter lived than I thought. It's not like, absolutely never cross own path, it's just, don't cross own path for a while. Okay, so not convenient to do anything there. I'd like to reorient and touch a checkpoint, because I've made some meaningful progress. Those all reorient the same way, so I need to do it three times. One... Oh, jeez. Two... Uh-huh, uh, three! Okay, there we go. Locked in. All right, this is not so bad, then. So if I'm here, I need down to be left. And I think that's three reorientations from where I currently am. I want to see this 
expire. I saw it. Okay, that was sufficient for me. Okay, three reorientations. Left needs to be down. One, two... Ah! And I'm dead. One, two, three. And ah, that was four. Oops. Ah! <laughs> this is a little awkward, and the just as gentle as it is, the little bit of time pressure is enough to make me significantly clumsier than I would be without it. Okay, three, don't touch it again. And then, right, I wanted left to be down, so now down is what left was. This, navigating that field of things is a bit stressful. One, two, three. Okay, so now just go down. Let me go right a bit before going all the way down. Like, this is one of the nastiest little spots in the level, I find. It was the one I saw first, so that was a little intimidating when I first encountered all this. But, like, the rest is nowhere near as bad as this field of... field of nasty. Uh, okay. Ah, uh, got it. Alright, checkpoint, please. I don't actually know what I'm doing with these keycards. Going to the... staticky thing's home, I guess? Huh? Locked in. How am I on overall progress? Need red and yellow. Okay. Makes sense for directions for keycards. So I got the one down here already, right? Yes. That was a r no way. It couldn't have been red. It's one that I already have. Okay, so for this, which way do I want gravity? Ah! Well, that's fine. I should be getting these, by the way. Yeah! Let's try this way and see if it's any good. Uh, so that'll now be bottom right corner. Bottom right's no good. Or, sorry, uh, gravity this way is no good. Is this useful for the top right? Um, I can't make any of those jumps. It'll be quicker to reset. Makes more sense. I lose a couple of silver tokens. That's fine. Let's try two rotations and see how that goes. So now that'll be bottom left. Here we go. This way works. There are two valid orientations for this, and this is one of them. Dang it! <laughs> ah. Ay, okay, that's fine. Bottom left. This is pretty cool. Uh, okay, so careful. Um, uh, okay, gotta get back to the center. Rotate twice. Checkpoint is currently up above my head. One. Yeah! Oh shoot, I didn't realize what I had done. That was a loop. <laughs> of course it was. All these jumps are just, just high enough to be like Super awkward. You need to have the patience to just like <sighs> jump at the double jump at the peak of my single jump. But that's not like necessarily always obvious. Uh, corner I want is bottom left. I'd like to go clockwise around, exit out the top. I think I can do that. Sure. Wait, where am I going right now, actually? Probably the wrong way. I don't need to be here, I just need to do this. Oh shoot, I need to get back in there and do that again. It's probably fine. It's fine. Ah, there we go. All right. Last one will be in from this orientation, the upper left, I think. 
Yep, uncomfortable. Yep, dead. That's fine. Watch out. There was a... There's that other silver token. Can't really reach it right now. And I... Well, I got it. It was the last one. Yeah. If I just make this climb kind of slowly, then this will come around to a more friendly position. Okay, upper left. Which orientation haven't I used? The default one, maybe? So red. This has to be... Okay, so right has to be down. Yeah, one rotation away. Right. I didn't use that for anything. One rotation. Now the upper right corner. Uh, infested by static, though. I just need to hang out elsewhere for a bit. Could have checkpointed and locked in those silver tokens. Didn't think about it until it was a bit late. And I'm not undoing my rotation for that. Alright. Enough time has passed. I'm gonna hope that coming around this way will give me a friendly escape route! Whoopsie! Alright, so let's do this then. Just so that I can uh, not worry about it anymore. I mean, I can I can multitask here. I was gonna lock in my uh, my silvers, but apparently I'm not doing that anymore. I'll do it on the way back, maybe. Yeah, all these awkward, just a little too tall jumps, but doable eventually. Okay. I'm just gonna take my time and kind of let this happen for a bit. There we go. There's less to that trail than it looks like. So, I want the last thingy. I got the last thingy. I'm gonna rotate three times. There we go. All key cards, all tokens, ready to go. Uh, gravity needs to be different. Probably two rotations from here would be ideal. One, two. And then climb to the top. This is pretty cool. What an event. Uh, I don't really want to climb this, but I guess that's how I'm doing it. Works. Whoa! Clocked it. I think I made to beat the game. And for some sense of beating the game. Controller is shaking violently. Oh, it's having a good time here. Rumble, rumble. Okay, it stopped. <laughs> <laughs> what did I accomplish? Super Luma Dive! I beat the game! Yay! Who made this game? Gemi Games? Who is that? Tell me about yourself, author. You made a cool, fun thing that I enjoyed a lot. Alright, publisher, sure. Maybe they're not putting their game, uh, their name in the game. Okay, here we go. Marios Kalugaro. Ka Kalugar I don't know how to say that. <laughs> Sorry, but that's, that's your name. <laughs> Alright, cool. Three people doing music. Yeah, it looks like Marios is the main author here. Did most of everything. Licenses. All right then. 2015, this... No, that's for the, the license thing. I didn't think this game was that old. It's a few years old, but not, not that many, I think. Music credits, cool. 
So that's how those are identified. WA special. All right, spoilers. There's, the next world is called A. There was obviously another world, but it's not a six. <laughs> Bonus levels, skull levels. Right, of course. Final boss, level clear, all right. Yeah, check it out, High Sight, there we go. Named after that person. Hey, check it out, I'm here! Aw, well thank you for thanking me. <laughs> I didn't expect to see my game here, my, my name here, but there I am. What a super cool game. And we're not, like, even close to done here. Am I at the halfway point in the LP yet? Probably. So I'm expecting, you know, I, I finished this. That's great. I think I get it. So now that I've done the X world, the X gate at the end of the not final showdown, the, the, the skull level in world five will open, allowing me to get the clear on that, which is the trigger for opening up the path to the bonus world. That makes all of the sense. Okay, so having done this, uh, I want probably to clear that. Go for all levels cleared. Yeah, I haven't done even that yet. So I have, like, remaining secret business in world four, three, some worlds. Uh, I have the special world to open up. Let's do that, I suppose. Sure. Uh, I don't remember this. Oh, yeah, it's this level. All right, sure. So let's redo this. Just kind of a portal race. Whoa, I got pushed off the bottom. I expected it to get squished and die there, but something else happened. With the change that I can actually do something at the end now. Don't need to worry about anything except just actually getting there. Uh, then afterward, maybe I can look for the... Uh, oh, right, also... Not a whole lot of checkpoints coming during this. Uh, wait, what am I doing? All the wrong things. I could totally make it there without stopping, actually. Let's do that. It'll be quicker. <laughs> I'll have to restart 20 times instead of waiting like two seconds there. So much quicker. Let's, let's wait. I don't know, it's so tempting that if I'm on a good pace to continue, but no, just don't. It's a bad idea. He's like, this part is weird. I guess I could go down below. I don't have to take the upper route. Well, I did if I wanted to do this the quick way. There we go. Uh, no, 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 no. Okay, I figured it out. <laughs> what I was doing wrong and how to fix it. Oh, well, I'm gonna have to wait a bit longer. That's fine. Yeah, I think I want to open the special world, but before I get serious with, like, actually clearing anything in it, I want to, uh, find that secret level I was missing. Whoopsie. Where does this put me? Here? Okay, that's fine. Let's take the lower route. With the spring. I think that's actually a lot quicker than, uh, what I was doing there. And there isn't, like, a huge, huge amount to this, uh, level, right? I think it's just a, a normal amount. There's no checkpoint here. Was it in the previous room? Did I not wait long enough for it? Maybe there wasn't one there. Well, let's just not die and not need it. How about that? Poof. What an effect. I remember that spot. Okay, here we go. So, checkpoint, jump field. Yo, fast moving things. I just kind of went and didn't really look at them. And I died as a result. That's what happens. Shelter, thank you. Does that exist? No, not in the real world. Oh right, this. I remember this. 
There's a one weird jump here. This one! There we go. And then I have to keep going. Hey, check it out. One shot at it. Nice. And now, check mark! It opens for me. Here we go. And I got a good clear. Nice. All right, I can totally get gold on that. I'm more and more, the more of this I do, I'm getting quite convinced that I actually want to go for all the golds. So that'd be like loop three after I, uh, well, not loop three really, loop two. Special place. I'm still in, uh, still in loop one looking for uh, this secret. Let's clean this up. So I definitely did not spot a, um, portal anywhere in this world. It wasn't in either of those pits, by the way. <laughs> I figured I'd check. So, roomy areas, you say. Maybe I shouldn't assume it's not in this pit down here, but that's what I'm doing. Oh, did I not find this first? Oh, I didn't. Okay, well, that's... I'm surprised I didn't spot it, but I could see how that would have happened. Okay, yeah, so... Another co- What? I guess I had more leftward momentum than I thought. Uh, another consequence of using colors for that is it means... Because my sense of color is altered in the netherworld, it's harder for me to tell... When those things are coming back. Ah! Okay, so this resets my left-right velocity, because I'm, like, steering left to correct for my rightward momentum, but it's just it's just gone at that point. So I don't need to. Ah, it almost worked! And there's things shooting at me, too. <laughs> just for fun. Ugh. All right. Let's try a different route. So don't press left. Oh shoot, my different route didn't work. Going down's not too hard, going back up is much more of a problem. I don't know how I'm gonna do it, actually. Uh, right, there is a timer up there, I have 20 seconds for this. Maybe I can do this more slowly and methodically. It seems that I can. Yes, okay, that worked much better. <laughs> Just don't try to go too fast. Decisive move! So, portal's up there. Okay. I could jump down. Let's instead touch this and see what it does. Gets me access to you. If I stand on you, you just go up. Sure, fair. And you will return eventually. Yeah. Alright, this all seems fine so far. Can I get low enough and back? I think so. Yes. Well, what this about? Hmm, suspicious. A checkpoint, but there's a very suspicious thingy here. Yep. Whoa, okay, that's fine. Well, I got all the things, and I can exit, so let's at least do that. Were there any golds? They're probably all in that secret section. How do I get to the secret section? If I, if I uh, go down here, does that help? Not yet. Wait. Is this a time thing? Is it an orientation thing? I don't think it's an orientation thing, so if I take this route... Is it an interact with these blocks thing? Whoopsie. So I interacted with you. I interacted with you a little bit. I just don't know what triggers that uh, mechanism to move. If I move you, it doesn't help. I can't make another loop around here because, uh... Because the red arrows consume themselves. 
Okay, let's interact with all the mechanisms and then see if that helps somehow. It doesn't seem like it did. What makes you do your thing? Is it just kind of generally going in here? No. It's gone at that point. Is it sensitive to orientation? Like, what is the deal here? So, closed. I can't make it up there. It's not time. Open. Why, though? So if I were to reorient here first... And then, like, take this route? That's just the exit. Go here. Here's this thing. Let's see. I've touched both reorientations now. So what? Mm. Okay, well, that doesn't help me. So I can take the exact actions I would take here without reorienting, and that is closed. So it seems like it is touching the reorienters that opens that up. But not this reorienter. Can I get to the other one? Whoa! Okay. So I can maybe do some kind of like boost jump there. I wish they, like, made a noise when they opened or something, so I would just know what triggered it. So if I boost here, I can maybe go there. I think that's actually a jump I can do. It is. Okay, I'm, uh, I don't think I'm onto anything there. Like, there's no way I'm touching that. And continuing to go around probably won't benefit me. That was my starting point, and that's the exit. If I go here, what do I see? This old place. It's not opened. What? And I need it to be in a different orientation than what it is right now. Well, this one but I rechecked after that and it wasn't... Oh, it is open now. What? Was that always how it was? I was sure I had done that action, but maybe I'm wrong. Oh, I see. I need the boost. hoo Got it. <laughs> that was fun. Oh, and I didn't have a limited number of tries. I just needed to... Uh, just would need to wait if I was slow. All right. Cool. So that is... 4D. Okay, old business done. Stats should look better now, right? Yeah, 100%, 100%, 100%, 100%, 100%. 0% anything. Cool. Huh, a lot more silvers, a lot fewer silvers in Season 4 than anywhere else, including Season 5. Huh. Oh, and I don't even have all the bronzes in these two... What does bronze mean? Just, like, don't get a terrible time or something? I guess so. Because I, I don't remember ever seeing something that told me, like, a time to get for bronze. I just see silver and gold here. So, like, which which level don't I have a bronze on? This one, Tower of Power, my time just isn't even registered? Uh, not what I'm after. Oh, here are uh, global stats, by the way. K, 
Okay. So I just don't... Like, if I click this, it just goes in here. So I just don't even have a time here. I guess it was more than uh, uh, 10 minutes. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. All right, so... Uh, got lots of things to do, but I think probably next time I'm going to focus on Season A in here. Special place. I'll see you then for that.